Ladies and gentlemen, you know, there were two back-to-back -back very strong quakes in California over a 24-hour period. Well, it left cracks in the earth so big they could be picked up by satellite. And that right there is evidence that this was really, a you know, two very powerful quakes that California has gone through in such a short period of time. You know, those folks are so terrified now. They are sleeping outdoors and afraid to go back in their homes. You know, psychologically, ooh, that can jack you up. It really can, going through something like that. So my heart goes out to people in California. I hope you all stay safe and just make the best of your situation and just be glad there weren't a lot of fatalities. It sure could have turned that way. So this is USA Today, July 9th. 2019 California quakes left a crack in the earth so big it can be seen from space. The two massive earthquakes that rocked Southern California last week not only damaged roads and sparked fires, but also left a fissure in the earth so large it could be seen from space. Planet Labs captured before and after satellite photos on July 4th and 6th that showed a rupture in the Earth's surface near the epicenter of Friday's 7.1 magnitude quake, which was 11 miles north-northeast of Ridgecrest, California. The photos were shared on Twitter by Will Marshall, CEO of San Francisco-based Earth Imaging Company. And here's where he shows those images right here. And let me see if I can get it a little bigger here. Here we go. Wow. Yeah, you sure can see that. Look at that. That was taken by a satellite, y'all. Ooh. Yeah, that was a powerful quake. No doubt about it. You know, I just think, uh, I'm just glad the fatalities were not anything. And, and the injuries, they said, were minor. And I'm just glad to hear that. It would have been far worse if you had to send out rescue teams and people were missing. I think it would have been a lot more devastating. The crack, which stretched through the Mojave Desert and across a highway, has become somewhat of a local attraction, the San Francisco Chronicle reported. The rupture was initially about two inches wide and eventually becomes deep enough for brave spectators to reach their limbs and side, according to the Chronicle. Friday's quake which followed Thursday 6.4 magnitude earthquake occurred along a series of small faults unrelated to the San Andreas Fault, a 750 mile fault line running almost the entire length of California. They were the strongest to hit the state in two decades. Yeah, that's what they said. And here's another shot of, wow, look at that road. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, I want to get rid of that. Um, here's the Mojave Desert, and you can see the cracks there as well. Wow. The quakes could be felt in cities like Phoenix, according to the U.S. Geological Survey in Las Vegas. There were no fatalities or serious injuries reported, but a number of power outages, fires, and road damage were attributed to the quake. 
California Governor Gavin Newsom toured the hardest hit area over the weekend. The estimated $100 million in damage, wow, uh, would have been much higher had the epicenter been in an area such as Los Angeles rather than the remote uh, Ridgecrest area, he said. Yeah, he's right about that. Yeah. Oh, man. I just hope that everything can get back to normal in California. You know, I think a lot of people still have what happened on their minds. And it didn't help that they had made a prediction of another quake is coming. And I think that has made a lot of people very uneasy. And this is why they are afraid now to go back in their homes to sleep. But hopefully, you know, everybody will slowly get back to normal and remain safe in California. But I will definitely keep my eye on these type of stories along with other disasters that are going on in the country, because my goodness, there are a lot of them going on right now. And it just seems like they are coming on top of each other these days. But please tell me what you think, ladies and gentlemen. Please leave your comment and subscribe. Don't forget to hit on the notification bell. And I'll see you on the next video. Peace, family.